You've most likely heard about 5G and might be thinking it's all about smartphones. Well, it's going to benefit the automotive sector as well. I recently traveled to San Diego and visited the Qualcomm 5G Automotive Lab and talked to Sherry Willie, the Director of Product Management. She had an awful lot to say about the technology and I wanted to share some of our talk. 5G in the car is not just a 5G smartphone in the car, it's actually embedded in the car. What makes that better? Right, so, so yes, that's right. We're talking here about 5G, which is built in at the factory by the car maker. And what that brings to the car is a system which is purposely designed to work with that uh -huh. exact vehicle. Right. And it will bring these higher data rates for better user experiences to all of those screens that you see in the cars nowadays, yeah. as well as other use cases that will make the vehicle safer and give it more options to communicate with its surroundings. One key advantage to 5G is speed. It's gonna open up a lot of entertainment options like 4K movies and gaming with incredibly low latency. You're never gonna hear, are we there yet again? 5G in a smartphone allows you to do things like download cat videos faster. But what is it going to do to improve the car experience? So there's a couple of ways that the car experience will change. So you could certainly download cat videos if that was something you wanted awesome. to do. Yeah. Um, as if you can imagine the passenger or your kids in the back seat, streaming content, playing games, you know, all of these kinds of entertainment that we're used to on the little screens on our phones, you can have those experiences in the car. Up until now, automotive safety has been about crumple zones, seat belts, and airbags. Now, add 5G to that. 5G can bring a complementary technology to all of those safety features in the vehicle. So 5G has the capability to communicate with vehicles. Wow. We call this cellular vehicle to everything. So this allows cars to communicate with their surroundings. And what this does is this provides a complementary system that enhances those other safety features, crumple zones, lane keeping, automatic braking, with information that can be received beyond the sight that the driver can see, or beyond the hearing distance of where you could hear an ambulance coming. And it can provide an enhancement to the way that the car understands its surrounding. We've all been waiting patiently for the autonomous car. 5G is gonna help make that a reality. The vehicle itself needs to be able to understand its surroundings, to understand what kind of environment it's driving in. And so this is where the technologies of the communication with the network, communication with other vehicles, mm -hmm. mapping data, can feed into the car to give it that data set. In addition, 5G will also complement the other sensors in the car and the detection of the other vehicles around the car to understand intent, who's gonna change lanes in front of you, who's speeding up, who's slowing down. So that communication with the network and, and with the environment uh -huh. makes the, the car able to be part of a bigger landscape and interact with that landscape. That's just some of my talk with Qualcomm's Sherry Willie. If you wanna see the entire video, I've provided a link in the video description. I highly suggest watching it. It'll give you a good idea of how 5G is going to change the automotive landscape. And special thanks to Qualcomm for making this happen. I'm Tom Volk.